Hello, and welcome back to The Sims 4 Hunter Baby Challenge. So there is a lot of new stuff I have to talk to you guys about. Like, a lot. Um, first of all... Woo, okay, well, I don't know where to start, actually. I redid the house and also gave Annalie a new makeover. So, I gave Annalie a new makeover because, like, when the thing was updated, like, when the game was updated, or whatever, like, I had to take my CC out because it wasn't functioning right, so she didn't have anything on her. So, yes, she has been redressed. And she looks really different, and it's weird. I don't know. When I was doing, like, her stuff, I was like, I honestly couldn't remember what she looks like before. But she is slowly transitioning her hair from black to either red or blonde. That's what she's doing right now. That's why it's like a dark brown. I don't know. I just decided to do that for some reason. I could have just gone to blonde, but I was like, nah, let's transition. Plus, this looks really pretty. So she's just tending her garden, and then she's going to go cook dinner. But let me show you all about the new renovations we did. So for the living room, we just have a lot more style going on. It's really pretty. I love it. I love those curtains so much. And the kitchen actually kind of looks like a lived-in kitchen now. It's not just like completely empty. And then Annalise's bedroom got a huge upgrade. She has the most expensive computer and a really nice bed and stuff. And then the kids' room is super adorable. They have a lot of nice stuff that they can play with now, and I'm super happy about it. So you guys may be wondering where we got all the money to do this. Well, this is where I get mad at The Sims 4. After I got City Living, it completely messed up my game, like, a lot. And I don't even know why, but it basically, like, thought that I had a whole new household, so it gave me, like, $20,000 and stuff, which I was like, at first I was like, okay, I'll get rid of it. But then I realized it reset the Sugar Skull collection, so like I would have had to restart all over and there's like no point to that. So I just kept the money because it made me not get to keep finishing my Sugar Skull collection, which we were so close to, so I'm super upset about that. Oh, and there's like a lot of cute artwork everywhere. That's the one thing I hate is I wish artwork, like you could see it when the walls, when that wall specifically isn't up. But yeah, so that's what we're working with, and there's something I think that's really important that I'd like to talk about. When I was giving Annalie her makeover, she had, like, no clothes on, of course, because it was, like, all CC, which now it's not, actually, just the shorts are. But, um, I could actually see her ribs, which doesn't make sense to me because I never made her that skinny, and she's had, what, four children? And it was kind of scary. It seems like whatever medicine Annalie is taking to keep her in control because she's been really in control lately and that's why it's affecting her and that's true with a lot of medicine for like depression I don't know necessarily for like the medicine she's taking I think she is taking some depression medicines that are trying to counteract oh boy what's going on with her but um it's really making her skinny. I've never seen ribs on a skin on a sim before. And it was honestly pretty scary. And she's cooking level 4, which is pretty awesome. And of course, this has a weird glitch where it says they're still at school even though they're not. Harry, no. Even I'm actually thinking I'm going to invite Harry over so that he can get to know his child, which I don't remember. Is this one Harry's? Yes, so he can meet Blaze. Oh, we're... And, um, Milk and Land Grab is over here, which will be a little interesting. He's actually in here. He's actually here because Amber is really into him, and she's been talking to him for a while now. But I think the last time they talked, he, like, started denying her. Yeah, like, it started going downhill. <laughs> but she really likes him. So if anything happens between Annalie and him, that might just be the last straw. I'm hoping after they go to school tomorrow, this will go away and fix itself. 
Don't be mean to your mother. Why are you mad at your mother, Blaze? You're supposed to get along with her because you're both mean people. Well, I guess she's not mean. At least she hasn't been. She's been pretty good. And actually, I figure tonight it has... No, Malcolm, you're not allowed to go. Whatever. We'll see him some other time. Tonight, we're going to age up the child that was supposed to be aged up. Andrew. So we're just going to have, uh, once they're done eating, have Annalie come over and age him up. Because he really was supposed to be aged up quite a long time ago. But we, you know, the whole accidentally aged up Blaze thing happened. Yeah. Pretty sad. Okay. Hurry up. I want to see what Andrew looks like. But so I'm thinking for Annalie, maybe we'll start having her exercise or something so she can build up muscle. Because she's kind of just skin and bones and it's scary and that doesn't make sense because, like, she's pregnant most of the time. But whatever. And we also need to get her pregnant again. Who is the next person we were going to? Did we have a baby with Julian? I don't think so because none of our kids' last names are Rain. So he's the next person we're having a kid with. What's your na last name? Did I accidentally... Oh, they were twins. That's why. That's why. Okay. So why don't we actually just invite Julian over right now? If I can. Maybe I can't. Oh, yeah. Okay. So blah, 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 blah. He's that and then not looking. I hate this part. I really should do a random thing, but it's like completely out of it. And it's... Okay. Andrew Screamish. Cute. What's he look like? Hang on. Oh god, his hair is way too short for my taste. But he has style. Besides those shoes, which obviously will need to be changed, he has quite a nice style there. We'll edit him and create a sim later tonight, I think. I really love this little sweater on her. I changed up her look and like... Because I didn't feel like... I felt like it was time. <laughs> she needed her look changed up a little bit. Alrighty, love. Your next boo is coming on over. Oh, it's Johnny's ass. I was about to yell at Harry, like, seriously. Who's that? Oh, that's our son. Why was he outside? We're going to give him a little old knock-knock joke. And try for a baby immediately. You know, getting pregnant. Okay. Should we buy some workout? Actually, we have a basketball hoop. I put this in because I thought it'd be fun for the kids. So maybe that that should maybe get her some muscles which i think are needed and he wants to stargaze with his brother which is cute but sweetheart you need to eat and his brother is apparently yelling at him are you gonna eat those franks and beans or talk to your brother this boy is a little terror he's gonna go practice dribbling which i think is super cute Darling, take care of yourself. She was on the computer all day. And she just got kicked out because her mom's doing it. I mean, um, enjoying some private time. <laughs> okay. And then after that, you can have some food. That's... Why isn't it coming up? That's really weird. It's not like when I'm clicking the open so that you can eat leftovers. It's not coming up. So she'll just have some cereal, I guess. And then she can go to sleep. And then... She can go ahead and do that. Get her fun up so that she's not horribly depressed for school tomorrow. And we have to make sure she's pregnant, but there is a child in there. So we're just going to go ahead and try for baby again. Oh! Yes, and lot traits. I added some lot traits in the New City Living, and one of them's the chance of twins lots, and apparently that has feeling pretty pumped. Emily's chances of having twins are pretty high, which is pretty awesome. A welcome for Sim is a happy Sim. That's cute. I don't think I've ever really read that. Let me just sell some of the things we got from our garden. We are doing really well with money, I would say. And honestly, I don't think we need a bigger house. We could just add, like, one more room and have enough room for eight sims, but we probably need another bathroom, too. 
If we had an upstairs, this house would be perfect. I really like this house. I'm proud of it because I built it. Alright, he's upset from his brother being a little terror. We're going to have him go ahead and go to sleep. Blaze, darling. We're going to have you go to sleep in the pink bed. Oh, well. And you can pee and sleep. Oh, and they have little bubbles, which I want to try out tomorrow. Then everyone's going to sleep, correct? Mando? What is she wearing? That's not what she's wearing. Is it? Did her outfit change? I didn't notice. Oh, well. Okay. So they have woohooed twice. And I'd like to have her take a pregnancy test to see if she's pregnant. And I'm hoping it's with twins. And I just had a little weird reset thing going on. Don't know why. Darling, you need to sleep. You are tired. He's asleep. He's yelling at Buffy because his brother made him really mad. So I can tell that him and Blaze are not going to be getting along. <laughs> Which is sad, but nothing I can do about it. And she's going to be seeing if she's pregnant. And she wants to kiss someone, so we'll have her go ahead and kiss him. If we can click on him. It didn't tell me if she was pregnant. Do we have to take another one? I don't know what's going on. It didn't tell me, so I have to take another one. And what she wants to do, she wants to try for baby. So I mean, I guess we could do it again anyways. <laughs> and she wants to kiss Julian, because he's so irresistible. We're actually gonna try for baby with him. Yeah, good. Complete 100 wins across all sims, that's cool. Girl, you're doing something romantic all the time. I really hope we have twins then. And then would we have a full household then? One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, we will have a full household, which means Anna, or Amber probably won't be staying here much longer, which is true. She honestly probably won't be staying here much longer after something I have in mind happens, of course, which you can guess. It's pretty obvious. She's had this whim clicked since like the first episode. Not even kidding. Alrighty. Emily has had a lot of fun tonight. You don't need to sleep, love. And after we find out you're pregnant, because you totally should be, we will have you book practiced practice the writing. Apparently she does not want to take a pregnancy test, which is really starting to annoy me. Are all my kids asleep? No, they're well Wait, yes they are. Okay, good. And then you can just go ahead and sleep in Annalie's bed while you can. Because she now doesn't have a bed. And we need to get preggers here. What book are we writing, by the way? I think we're on Andrew, so we still have to do Blaze? Or are we on Blaze? I'm not sure, we'll find out. Okay, I really want to know if we're pregnant, so we'll resume writing afterwards. Hmm. I wonder why she's so energized. Oh, it's from the law trait. So, the other traits we have is good school, and um, I'll show you in a moment. Once I just figure out what's going on here. Okay, there we go. Come on, love. You know, she probably shouldn't be wearing this around her kids. But it's to entice the men. Okay, now... Alright, yeah, she's pregnant. She should be. There was no way she couldn't be after that. Alright, and then... So we have good schools, the twin rate, and... Uh, child's play. Kids seem to learn faster here. I don't know why I chose that one. Just so, like, they can age up faster, kind of? Yeah, what do they need to achieve an A? Do they all have that done? Yes. 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 And he obviously wouldn't. But we can have him work on his social skill tomorrow. She be cleaning that toilet. 
All right, we will have her grab a bite to eat. Why don't we have her make some ice cream for herself? Let's just do some plain old vanilla ice cream. Okay. What? What do you mean you can't reach it? It's literally... How can you not reach that? Okay. That does not make any sense. Oh, because I have the cupboards merged there. That would be why. I am holding a window. Not what I wanted to do. <laughs> Alright. Now she can craft some nice vanilla ice cream. And then she will go to sleep. And she wants to stargaze with her daughter. Which I think we will do. Do do do. Getting some of that delicious ice cream. I wonder if that would be numbers or not. Ooh, she's adding in the flavoring. I like her tattoo a lot. I actually forgot she had that, but you can now see it through her shirt because it's like that partial see through shirt that came to City Living, and it's super cute. I love it a lot. How long does it take for ice cream to be made? Dang. Okay. The carton has been added to her inventory. Wait, no. You want to eat it. Grabbable. And then you can sleep. Let's look at this delicious ice cream we made here. Oh. Just... Oh, that's actually really professional ice cream. Good job, darling. Can I, like, put this on the... Can I put it somewhere else? I mean, I could place it in the world, but it's not letting me. I want the kids to be able to have it when they wake up in the morning. And she's feeling angry because she's insane. What a surprise. I love how in the beginning, Amber was like supposed to be like our old best friend, and she was moving in to help us. And now it's just like she's kind of not a part of anything. She's just been in the background for the whole thing, which I think it's why it's time for her to move on. And I think she is kind of looking to move on with Malcolm Landgrab, because he's super cute, and why not? Well, I mean, he's not super cute to me, but, like, he's okay. <laughs> he's okay. And she put the ice cream out, didn't she? How are you still eating ice cream, though? Like, come on. Well, now you have to pee. See, you're going to be up all morning now, because it took you this long to make ice cream which didn't even fill you at all and I don't even think you put it anywhere oh there it is so when the kids wake up they can have some delicious ice cream for breakfast because that's the nice nutritious meal you need every day all right there we go ranking in that dough Alrighty, children wake up children are waking up what do we need here Food. I'm going to have you eat real food, actually, Blaze, even though I know you'd love some ice cream, because that won't fill you. You wake up. You have a quick meal of some yogurt. You, my love, can go ahead and grab some excellent ice cream. You deserve it. I'm hoping that they'll age up soon. What if they don't go to school because it says that they're at school? I hope that doesn't happen, because that'd make me super mad. She can't go to sleep because this bitch is still in her bed. That's not acceptable. This is Annalise's bed. She's going to sleep in it. Darling, you don't have to sleep in your child's bed. What she wants to do, make a group meal. We could definitely do that. We'll have to make dinner tonight. What trimester are we in? Doo -doo. Well, we're still in the first, which isn't surprising, but... Our kids are so adorable. Look how much kids we have, and none of them are teenagers yet. Like, seriously, not a single one of them are teenagers yet. Um, the girls are obviously almost to an A, though, because... Yes, so they can be aged up probably in the next part or so. Um, hang on. Oh, gosh. Dropping things. I don't want them to go... I don't want them to move out... They're so cute. But we definitely need to to move on. Oh, 
And I totally fixed the aging thing. That was my fault. I don't think I actually fixed it in the game. So I should do that. So now that she will age up and grow old, though I don't know if I really want her to, but realistically, she can have 100 kids. She's already had four and probably twins on the way. So like, I mean, she's she should be an adult by now. Did I do that? Okay. But we're just going to let her age up to what she needs to. She will be an adult in 20 days. So we'll have quite a lot of children with her, which is what I want. Alright, how are your needs? Really good, actually. They're all really good. You're all super cute. Blaze, why don't you go ahead and grab a bowl of ice cream, because I didn't let you have one earlier. And Andrew, you can also grab a bowl of ice cream, because I love you both. And you need to earn your keep. <laughs> Even though we honestly don't need money, but why not constantly have money? If it's an option, might as well. Do, 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 do. We could have had her, like, start painting, but nah. It's honestly getting too late for that now. No, I don't want you to go here. I want you to click and harvest. We're probably ending this part pretty soon because it's been like 22 minutes. But I want the kids to come home from school so the girls can age up into teenagers. Ooh, I wonder if we can actually accomplish that today. I don't know. Wait, why aren't you in school? They're not going to school. I don't know what to do. How am I supposed to fix this? See, it says they're at school, but n they're not. Okay. I'm going to end this part here. In the next part, hopefully, I'll have this all situated. Alright, bye guys.